Hi everybody, welcome back to Nessa's Nook. Today I'm going to do a grocery haul because Kendra always wants me to do grocery hauls, which I don't understand why. Kendra over at uh, Kendra Full of Joy, or Full of Love, excuse me. And um, I'll tag her in here anyways. So I know this seems kind of funny, this grocery haul, but anyways. So I went to the dollar store because I went to the next town over and I got my hair cut because my daughter's wedding is Saturday. So I use these two and a half gallon bags um, when I empty my freeze dryer, the trays, when I have like the full five trays full of something, I use these to dump that in and then, then I put them in the bags or the, um, half gallons or whatever. Then of course, anything that's sticky, you're going to want parchment paper. I bought five more pounds of the pink Himalayan salt. They actually had the chicken fried steak that I absolutely love. That was like $10 now. Anyways, I got two of the white chocolates, and because this is all Kendra's fault, these uh, uh, caramel bites, I got four more of those because I'm afraid that they're going to stop making those, and I did not have that much fun peeling each caramel uh, for that uh, caramel apple dump cake, because I have some more apples that I want to make up into pie filling. And my husband will be nice to me, and he'll probably open up this jar for me. I'm always afraid of opening these jars. So, when I was down the aisle looking for stuff, and um, my husband does not like the white pastas or the sauces, but I still sometimes do. And so I bought one of those, and I bought the fettuccine, and I have some broccoli out in my freezer. And then I love this until I can um, get my strawberry extract that I'm making um, then I'll start making my own strawberry uh, cookies but I add those with the white chocolate they're absolutely amazing now there is a Stony Brook um, probiotic yogurt I make my own homemade yogurt and um, I did actually freeze dry some of this and we did make a batch of yogurt out of it and the yogurt came out incredibly thick even though it was mostly a, the gallon of 2% with just a little bit of uh, whole milk mixed to it. Then I bought some of this rotisserie chicken seasoned breast. Um, I was given some of those like uh, Hawaiian roll type things and we don't eat pork so I thought wow that tastes really good maybe like some chicken with something or another and then my husband can use the rest for lunch meat. This week we're going to have some hamburgers at some point. I have not bought a Woman's World magazine in like, I don't know how many years. Uh, we usually buy bananas every week and I don't try to buy a whole bunch at one time because they go to bed really bad. Uh, the fettuccine. And then um, because I add the pie fillings, either my own pie filling or the store bought, I don't have any homemade cherry pie filling. So I do buy that from the store. My big bag of lettuce because I eat lettuce or salads usually five to seven days out of the week. And um, there's times I don't want to use my freeze dried mixed vegetables and I use them all up to put them in the freeze dryer. So yeah, so this way I'll have some that's actually just in the freezer and I can just pull it out really simple. So this is my grocery haul. Like I said, this is not something that is like everybody else's grocery haul. Most of the stuff is um, like going for the pantry. Uh, this is for the pantry. This is for the freeze dryer. Um, this is definitely not what we eat in one week. But um, I just stopped, like I said, over at Walmart because I was in the next town over getting my hair cut. So anyways, here you go, Kendra. So you wonderful, have a wonderful, very wonderful day. And uh, thank you for stopping by. Have a blessed and wonderful day.